so hey guys this is my second video today so i'm kind of on grind mode right now no, i'm just kidding so it's just taking a really long nap <laughs> so i have time to film and my room is already clean so let's get it so i am here with a petunia pickle bottom diaper petunia pickle bottom boxy diaper bag pack and this is in the color black with a review and a diaper bag update please stay tuned okay, so first we're gonna start with this flap right here it's um it has like a little magnet kind of that sticks to this that sticks to this bottom part let me move the camera a little bit so you guys will see like half of my face but half of the diaper bag as well actually no that's perfect so yeah so even if i don't clip the little buttons it kind of like sticks together you see it doesn't come off okay and then my next part this is kind of my favorite right here these little zippers this is going to be the front pocket these little zippers are the changing pad mat so you just unzip it and it opens wide like this so it's pretty long so it's three sheets long and it has velcro on it you can take it off and wash this part this is just the head part so it probably won't get dirty and once you wash it you can just put it right back in there and then it comes with a white bee box um i decided to use it i mentioned in my other what's in my diaper bag that i didn't really like them but i don't really i'm not i don't really go out too much so i don't run out of white bees so it, it works I carry, I carry three diapers in here and i'm currently using the huggies little movers and i buy them at costco it's the i but i believe they come a little bit with a little bit more diapers these are size five and i'm still a bigger fan of little snuggers so the red box with the Winnie the Pooh on it. Um, actually, I'm sorry. These are size four. She wears size four at the moment. Um, these, her poo and pee still kind of go through sometimes. So, Little Snuggers is still my all-time favorite. That's all I carry in this pocket. So, moving on to this little side slot. It can be used for a water bottle, a bottle, any kind of like drink. And I just carry my keys on that side because it's, it's easier to access. And it has another one on this side. And I don't carry anything in there. It's just empty. Unless I do have a water bottle with me for myself. I'll put it in there. I hook my hand sanitizer on here. And it comes with these two straps. And they're for the stroller. They're stroller hooks. So if you have a stroller that isn't like a completely connected from the handles and you can use it or you can buy mommy hooks two mommy hooks one on each side you can hang it that way and moving on to the inside so the inside is huge guys it's it is just huge i'm gonna move the camera just down so you guys so it can point inside so you guys can kind of see what i have in there so like that. okay so at the moment it's really messy i carry somewhere in here okay I carry three bottles they don't have water in them because it just washed them but I am gonna put water in them and put them back in here and I am missing one so I carry three bottles with four ounces of water and these are the even the natural flow one and the nipple is a size one so that's that I actually don't want it to point. I actually want you guys to see me a little too. Okay. Then I carry this Ziploc bag with cleansed um, teething toys and toys. So in here I have this hand-me-down book. It was Baby Angels. So it has this little teething, nibbling thing on there. I carry a book. This one I just got for her. It makes the plastic, the little... Um, I want to call it foil inside is not as worn out as this one so this one makes a lot more noise than this one so her bug this one's a mini Disney edition then I have this um, 
lactating strawberry so this is like chewy and as they like chew on it it vibrates and that's pretty much it it's like a little strawberry and I did pick up the um, teething banana toothbrush at Target for like four dollars not so long ago she's not a big fan of it so I just I carry it just in case maybe she'll want to become a fan of it later and another little toy she likes to use this as a bracelet catches her attention so that's that then carry my wallet inside and um, I've been carrying this one because if you haven't watched the video I just posted um, I lost my other one why well, I left I misplaced it so I've been using this one I believe this one is from the 99 cent store I think or from the dollar store um, it was a gift so and it is useful it does its job so I put four ounces of powder formula in here and I am just I have decided to carry two of them so I just bought this one it doesn't have milk in it yet because I haven't washed it but I will and I will put it in here I want I carry two, I want to carry two because there has been times where I run out of milk in here so this will be handy and I just don't want to carry the whole thing of milk so this is it then I have a swaddle um, I believe this one is by Aiden this is my favorite if you guys haven't watched my other videos my favorite kind of swaddles it's not the bamboo kind though it's just a regular kind I carry a really big bib just for in case I'm feeding her food somewhere so a bib um, a little sweater this is a Carter's little pink sweater it's not too thick so it'll probably just go over a long sleeve then I carry a long sleeve shirt this she is not a sister to anyone yet but I figured why give it away if she can wear it under anything anyway so I carry like the the clothes that I don't put on her the most so this is just an undershirt for stuff I carry a burp cloth for her milk and to burp her um, I carry these things they are for the ergo baby um, carrier so I carry them in my diaper bag because the carrier is in the car and I don't want them to get dirty. So I did get a new carrier by the way. Um, I got it on offer up for $30. It was used so I just washed it and I love it. Um, I got I carry a beanie just in case we're out and it gets cold. Then I don't know why this isn't there. I guess I used it the other day carry a pair of socks and I carry a onesie um, yeah I carry a pair of pants or tights apparently I have two beans in there I should have cleaned I should have repacked it and cleaned it out but I didn't I thought it was already clean so but it wasn't I usually carry this one instead of this one because the ball kind of like doesn't really fit in the car seat so I usually carry this one this one I only carry it if it goes with her outfit so and then these little mittens, they go with the beanie, but I carry them in a diaper bag in, in case we're out somewhere and it's cold at night. She can have her hands out with her mittens. She likes to chew on them. So that is the inside. That is the clothes portion. So let me show you guys. That is how big it is. So it's really deep and long and wide. And it has one, sorry, one, two, three, Four, four milk slots and then it has this little zipper in the inside and I don't carry anything in there and it has this little hook I guess this is for the keys but it's not com pretty convenient to use um, then I also carry my little safety kit you guys watch my video um, you guys will know when the, what's in there the only thing that changed that's in there that's in there is this nose sucker I mean this bugger sucker so this one is the the newest kind of bugger sucker that they have came out with and it is the one that you just put you put this end in your mouth and I honestly believe that this works this work this actually works to take buggers I feel like the other one the one that comes that comes in the safety kit 
that they give you at the hospital the little thing with the point and the ball at the end i feel like that one doesn't work at all so this one is you just put it in your mouth this end and then this end goes in their nose and you suck and the boogers it has this little like sponge here the boogers get stuck there so and it comes with um stiff sponge to remove it so in case that gets full of uh, boogers you can just change it out so i feel like this is really this really works this one is the neil med um there is the other one the little noses brand um but this one was given to me by my aunt yannette and um yeah so i love it it works and everything else is the same um i have the teething cream the thermometer the syringe and a little toothbrush i don't know like and some um antibiotic wipes so that is actually all that i carry in my diaper bag on a regular base and then back here it also has one more slot um back here i carry my whip coupons because usually i will forget them and there's nothing else in there it's just a pocket and it has the backpack straps this is honestly like it has changed the way i go out like i will before i used to go out like maybe like once a day if anything but now i will i dare like i actually go out probably like two or three times in a day just because it is so easy like i have free hands i can get and i can carry any bag up and the baby like i don't have to worry about bringing one up first or one or the other or going back and getting in once she's asleep it's just so easy and it's so light since it is um the straps it's super light um the shoulder bags it does have a shoulder option i don't use it but um i don't know if you guys have seen anything like on social media a picture of what type of bags not to use and a very heavy shoulder bag is actually really bad for your back and the skip hop um chelsea bag that i had before this one was super heavy i couldn't carry anything in it and but the camera this camera that i use is super heavy so that whenever i carry that in here it's 10 times heavier so i have been using this backpack for um three weeks already and i just love it like i love it um it retails for 200 um with tax and everything i think it's like 208 I think that's how much it was um you can get it basically um at a nordstrom at a target no not at a target at a baby zara's at a bye bye baby and online of course um so you can get it at most of the stores and yeah i mean i uh, before i purchased it brand new i was looking for it on um on the resale resale pages which is um uh, little little posh and new poor kids resale but it is so hard to to find this colorway in those stores because the moment they post them they're gone um so instead of i didn't want to wait around anymore and um, lalo decided to give me this bag so we went ahead and bought it and but i also did see them on offer up in san diego um area there was none all around where i live but they i did find one for four dollars i just chose to go with this one the four dollar one was already really faded and used so since it was a gift i went for it but if you want to switch your diaper bag and you feel like it's just too expensive look for one online and there's also different colors so you can look for one on offer up on let go or on the resale pages so I'm going to wrap this video up. I have made it a little bit too long already. And I hope you guys enjoyed. Like, comment, subscribe. And if you guys have any video suggestions, please comment down below. Let me know what you think. Let me know what you carry in your diaper bag. Um, sometimes, I mean, I haven't came around it yet where I forget something. And I'm like, damn, like I never thought I would have to carry it. But if there's something that that has happened to you like that, please let me know so I can know to carry it now. So, yeah, that's it. Bye, guys.